Hi, I'm Kekla Magoon. I'm a young adult author. Kekla is a West African name. It, the language is called Basa, and uh, it is spoken in Cameroon, uh, West Africa, where my dad is from. Um, and it means sunrise or morning star. Uh, I'm a young adult author. I write mostly novels, uh, fiction. I've written two historical fiction novels about the civil rights era um, set in 1968 Chicago. And I've written two contemporary novels. Um, both, one is really for middle school students and one is aimed more at high school students. I'm currently the 2012 young adult writer in residence for the Miami-Dade Public Library System. The writer in residence program is grant funded by the John S. and James L. Knight Foundation and also supported by the Friends of the Library. And um, my program is uh, for me to work with 20 teens who um, are interested in writing and we meet every other weekend. So I have four groups of five students and we meet every other weekend over the course of 10 weeks. And I'm working with them on developing writing skills, learning about how to draw on uh, different inspirations from the world around us um, to tell stories and um, learning some of the basics of how to uh, be a good writer. Uh, librarians, um, set out applications to local schools and the library system, throughout the library system of course as well, um, and students submitted uh, writing samples um, with their applications and I got to read them and we had over 100 applica applicants for 20 slots, so it was I think a very successful outreach. Um, I've done three open workshops for writers, um, teen writers who are not in the mentoring program, the ongoing program, but want to come and participate and have a chance to work with a professional published author as well, um, so I've held um, one workshop on word play, like where do you get ideas and inspiration for writing, and then I did one on character building uh, where uh, we talked about, you know, what elements do authors need to know about their characters um, and how do you go about building characters. And the third one is about plot, um, you know, how do you develop a story and what elements need to be there and how do you build suspense in the things that readers are excited about wanting to turn the page and find out what happens next. I love working with teenagers, uh, they have so much energy and so much inspiration and so much talent um, and so much potential. Like they're, they're I have the sense of their whole life being ahead of them, um, but I also think that you know when I was a young person, I often felt that grown-ups looked down on you as a young person and said, you know, oh well, when you grow up, you'll understand this, or oh, you'll get better at that in time, and that may be true, but there's also a lot that young people can do right now. They're coming from a place of power right now and a place of energy right now, um, and so for me, it's fun to be in there with that <laughs> that energy and that inspiration. I want to be able to inspire them to keep pushing for the things that they want, um, but also I want them to know that what they're doing right now is just as valuable as what they're going to do in the future. And you know, I've talked to them about what they want to be when they grow up, and many of them want to be writers, some of them want to be something completely different, but one of the great things about writing is that you don't have to be only a writer. You can do many things and also write. Um, and so that's one of the things that's most important to me is to inspire teens to tell their own stories um, and to have writing be a part of their life if it's something that interests them. The last 10 weeks have been wonderful. I've very much enjoyed being in Miami. I've enjoyed working with these teens. Every single one of them has so much potential and so much to offer. And they're doing so much right now um, to express themselves and right now to develop their skills as writers. And it's been a privilege and an honor to be a part of this program. I'm so pleased that I was selected and I really hope that I will get to see the published works of my teens someday in the future because I definitely believe that all of them have the talent and the drive to actually get that done if they really want to and if they put their minds to it. So I look forward to seeing what happens with them in the future. I look forward to revisiting Miami and saying I've lived here for a little while and thank you so much to the Miami-Dade Public Library System and the Knight Foundation and the Friends of the Library for making this opportunity possible. Thank you.